This is a follow-up on the exercise we did for major triads. These are still gonna be root position, but it's going to be minor triads this time. I'm gonna eventually give you an exercise for all of the inversions also. So let's take a look at minor triads. Again, just like with the major triads, we don't need music for this. Once you learn your minor chords, you know your minor chords. So let's start with the left hand again, just like with major. And if you didn't watch my major triad example, please watch that for some of the technique that we're gonna go through here. We're gonna start with C minor. And what we're gonna do is move up chromatically or by half steps until we get back to C and play all 12 of the possible minor triads in roots position. Root position just means that the name of the chord is on the bottom. All right, try this with me, starting with C, E flat, G. If you get kind of stuck on any part of this, just stop, rewind, and watch it again. Ready, go. C minor, now go to D flat. Now up to D. Now up to D sharp, E flat. Now up to E, now up to F, F sharp, G flat, G, keep going, G sharp, A flat, then A, you're almost there, B flat, A sharp, keep going, one more, B, and let's do another one to round it off with C minor. Good job. And just like with major, watch what my arm is doing. Look, look how relaxed my arm is as I'm playing. Let's do the right hand and then we'll do it together. And I always do it a little bit quicker when I do it together. C minor, ready, go. C minor, up to C sharp, D flat. Now up to D. Now up to D sharp, E flat, E, F, F sharp, G flat, G, you're more than halfway there now, A flat, G sharp, A, B flat, A sharp, B, and then round it off with another C minor chord. Now I'm gonna do hands together. I'm gonna to go at a little bit of a faster tempo. Not too much faster though. But just watch me if this is too fast. At, th at the very least, watch it once first. Starting with C minor. Ready, go. by half steps, halfway there, almost there, and end it with a C. If you find that halfway through you end up playing a major chord, don't worry about it. Don't stop and start again. Just stop for a second, fix that chord, and keep going, and then go back through it again eventually it will become easier. If you keep stopping and starting at the beginning, it'll actually take a little bit longer to get better at this. I hope this was helpful. And again, like I said before, look for my major triad exercises. If you didn't see that one, I talk a little bit more about technique in that one. And I'll be doing some exercises for inversions very soon. So if you have any questions, please let me know. And I hope to see you in one of my group classes. If you liked that video, please give me a like. If you have any comments, please leave them underneath. And if you wanna see more videos, look to the ones over on the right of the screen right now and take a look at one of these or any of my other videos. And please subscribe if you wanna see anything new when it comes up. Thanks a lot.